No, I don't see you anymore. <laughs> so today, you might actually be able to hear a little bit of it upstairs. Um, I'm gonna show you, we have been working on uh, the upstairs bathroom at the moment because the new bathroom upstairs is gonna be next to this baby's room. So we wanna get the bathroom done because with Ella, she slept in a bassinet for like six months, so she wasn't in her room right away. So we figured get the bathroom done first, so that way the baby, baby can sleep, can nap, without all the noise. Just finished um, filming the sixth annual birthday party haul. That video has already been up for a while, but we have this here, and I really don't know what to do with this box. So I put all the goodie bags that we have in here, and then like the extra stuff. But yeah, we got that organized, but they're upstairs. This is the new bath tub right here let's head upstairs oh hey mom hi bud look at the mommy's daddy's building but i haven't shown I, any of this under yet under that floor is filled with a lot of pink <laughs> i know the guy found oh cute be careful come down for a sec um so this is gonna be so like you come in my hallway ella's room obviously is in here yeah, but then we have we have what's gonna be the baby's room. So we already have like the doorway out. Um, temporarily like storage stuff. Yep. Um, we have the crib that was Ella's in here. We have tile back there, which I think is not for this bathroom. I think it is for downstairs bathroom. Excess from the kitchen. But it's excess it's excess tile from our kitchen so we might not even end up use i'm not sure yet what are we working on right now t framing or uh I'm ripping out all the flooring so we can put a new floor. come on baby watch out and then i get to oh. step the on the stay right there for the Bathtub. So he had to get creative because <laughs> uh, the people who did this house before had pipes on the exterior wall. Um, this is basically a roof. Just decided to start coming down. Um, so we had to get creative because the people who built my house, my house used to be, let me, let me face you. This used to be a camp house basically. And then they added this top floor. They didn't add it to code, however. So the reason that my house got flooded, like my kitchen got flooded actually almost five years ago at this point was because they didn't properly pipe the upstairs bathroom. Um, the piping was actually kind of like an exterior part. It, it's hard to explain. This floor is technically an exterior. Like this is like wall. a roof. It's not like, a wall. Well, what is yeah. this? This one's the roof? This, this oh, is, that one's the roof. It's so hard to explain. This is an old roof that they build a second floor on top of. I'm just... This overhangs outside. If you look there on that crack, oh. it looks like it's lighting up because it is. It's a hinge. This piece. Oh, is that what's like down? Yeah. Like in the on yes. the porch. Yeah. It's Get like access plumbing. Yeah. Problem is, this plumbing. Even even while it was insulated, you can't have water lines running on an exterior part of the building right so we couldn't do and <clears throat> literally we couldn't put pipes on that wall on this wall so our only option was to do something kind of janky <laughs> and we had to use kind of like this flex pipe you can see down there we have hot and cold water running up and then we had to well he drilled holes into our new like what would be interior walls um because we're gonna have the bathtub here which i just showed you guys briefly downstairs and then there's already um piping like there our old sink was there so our sink is still gonna go there and then the pooper was over here which you might be able to still see there's like a pipe sticking out of the ground there let me see right here that's the old toilet pipe so all the piping is pretty much here but then we had to figure out a way to get piping over here for the draining shower all that fun stuff um and then once once we'll have like a wall obviously coming up here to separate the bathroom from the new baby's room 
and then you know we'll build a closet in there eventually and then the room is i think gonna be smaller than ella's room but i mean mm -hmm. it's, it's fine uh it's still gonna be a sizable room and then another project as you see well we're gonna need windows in here to keep our house up to code so we're gonna get a window here and then w we talked about like a window over there too right just to keep it symmetrical like from the outside and then as you see i have these windows in my bedroom as well but we have like these basement windows which will be gone to and replaced with um normal windows i will show you briefly in my bedroom that we have the same windows that I will eventually replace. <laughs> yeah. Um, so in here, let me turn you around. AC is on at the moment, obviously, but um, same basement windows, and those will be replaced. But down the line, notice that like even downstairs when I'm filming, if you can see the floor of my um, kitchen, there's no trimming, and that's because. We have so much trimming to do that we kind of want to just all do it at once. Um, so that's why like my hallway is just complete. It's not complete. This was a brand new wall. We had built this wall to block that off. So you got to like come around um, to come up the stairs. So I'm just kind of explaining. I've explained this before, but a lot of you guys are new to my channel. We do live, we're, we're in a starter home. I bought this house when I was 19 years old. We are planning on staying in this house for quite a while, but eventually selling it. So there's so much work to be done, um, but getting pregnant kind of kick-started uh, projects upstairs again. So that's what we are doing at the moment. Good morning, everybody. We, um, we just left Walmart this morning because we are going to be going to, oh, AC, to Water Country um, later today. I should say, like, it's 8.40 right now. I'm supposed to be picking up my family at 11. So we're probably going to be leaving by, like, 10.30, 10.45 the latest. But as I was trying to pack together our lunches to bring with us, I realized that my bread was no good. So I'm like, oh, crap. So we ran to Walmart. I had to get pull-ups for her anyways. Um, <clears throat> we got bread, and I needed some cat food, so... We have that, now we're gonna head back and actually put together our lunches, pack it up, and then we'll be on our way shortly. Not the best vlogger. <laughs> uh, thank you. I, uh, we're, we went to Water Country yesterday. Yes, please. And then I never recorded any of it, so today we're at Chuck E. Cheese's. Hi, Mom. We got it. <laughs> so, my bad. We're doing a big, su big super big rig. <laughs> game so <laughs> 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 Green one. 
one. Woo <laughs> blue one. Great blue one. Oh, close. Try again, there's another ball. Blue one. <laughs> You're almost there, bud. Okay, got two more. Right. Oh, so close. Oh, you gotta draw, toss them nice and easy, baby. Get the big one, get the good one, get the good one. Quick, quick, quick. Ah, quick. Oh. Try again. Throw hard. Oh, that one you almost got. Is that all the balls? I think that's it. The jackpot. <laughs> this one was really easy, but look at him come. That's it. Oh my goodness. All right. Nice job, babe. That's pretty cool. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> it looks like this was about five minutes left to wake up. Please miss the show. Oh. Yep, there you go. Woo! There it goes. Do you want to go? Oops. There you go. Whoop. You want to grab that, baby? I don't know how much I trust this sign. No frozen dough, no microwave, no reused pizza. We're about to get out of here, but we actually ordered something that was pretty cool. They're like unicorn churros. So I'm gonna, hold, I'm gonna do like a whole, yeah. I'm excited, but it's taking forever. <laughs> oh my God. They, uh, um, they brought us out churros and they're not the unicorn ones. So. <laughs> okay, sorry. I did not want to be loud in there at all. That's why I was trying to be like so discreet. Uh, hi guys. Um, so they have like regular churros, but then they have like a limited edition churro. And I was like, oh, I want to try that. And there are these unicorn ones. So they came out and it was just like regular churros with dipping sauce. And he's like, oh, you ordered churros? And I said, yeah, but they were supposed to be like the unicorn ones. And he's like, oh, okay. Do you need me to make you a new order? And I'm like, <laughs> If you don't mind, <laughs> it's not even what I ordered. So, um, but anyways, but we're gonna try them. Do you want to try one too, honey? I forget what kind of sugar they said was on them, but they have try a pink, them I'm pink, blue, and green. Try one. Tastes really good. I think so. You wanna try it? I think one's good. Go. Yeah? You want it? Oh. Oh. The green one's like a... Almost like a sour apple. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. I mean, the pink one tasted like... Ooh. Mm. It tasted like... Alright, now I'm curious what, what the blue one's gonna taste like. Tastes really good. Yeah, the blue one doesn't have much flavor though. So it's a pink one. I think the pink's probably my favorite, but. Ooh. Uh, they're all the pretty good. What's the matter, baby? The pink one tastes like a sour. Strawberry cookie. Mm. Oh my gosh. Oh, Alright, now we're just gonna head home. Honestly, we came out here for lunch. We had lunch. And then we went to Marshall's because I figured, well, instead of just going home, why not just hang out? Because like we're in a huge plaza with tons of stores. Um, I was gonna go see if we could find anything like maybe for back to school, but there really wasn't anything for kids, like not a whole lot for kids. So we didn't find anything, which is fine because I have so, like a favorite store I go to for her. Can I show them my new prizes I got? Sure. From you want you want to show them what you what you got? Yeah, I, I can't really <clears throat> reach. They can't see them yet. Oh, it's like a baby dolphin, right? And then what can else? Can you hold them for me and show them to them? Let me see. Yeah. Let me just do it safely. 
new parts somewhere, Ben. Well, I can just show them while driving. I just can't really like look. So she won a baby dolphin, which is exciting because. But they didn't have actually like black in its eyes, but but that's okay. We had like a baby dolphin a couple weeks ago that we lost. She's literally been talking about it ever since. So there's the baby dolphin. Thank you. And then she won two little spiders. So she got a blue one and she got purple. Would you say that's purple or would you say that's pink? It was pink. And a pink one. It's pretty cool, Bubba. That's a lot of prizes, huh? Hey, they're, they're, they're like translucent. They're a little bit translucent, uh huh? Yeah, you can see like the sun blending in. Actually, those are all the blue ones. Like had these tiny little pinchers. No, pink one actually has big pinchers. The blue one has little pinchers, and the pink has big pinchers. Yeah. Mhm. Mm yeah. If you blow them, they actually crawl. Ew. Yeah. If you blow them, they kind of move across the table. Yeah. So we're gonna head home. Um, I would really like to just kind of spend the rest of the day getting chores done. I have Nemo. Uh, Nemo's not uh, actually at Chuck E. Cheese, but he's like, he's not actually translucent, but you can actually see him. This is a Marlin. He's actually Nemo's son. Marlin is Nemo's daddy. And Dory is just their friend. And Pearl. And Pearl is Cookies Roll C's cat. <laughs> no. Yeah. Some funny Nemo. Girl, the girl fish. She's the same color as Nemo and her dad. Right? Um. Nemo's mama? Yeah. Yeah, I forget her name. What the heck is her name? What are you watching? See, okay? I think they say it once. I feel like it's coral, but maybe not. Or maybe it is, because I think he yells coral. Okay, it's coral. I think. Okay, it is, so... Let I... me know. So... Alright, I'm kind of want to wanna move back to the green one. I don't know. I think the green one might have been my least favorite out of these. The flavor is good, it's just a bit odd for like, not a candy. It almost tastes like a green Apple. Jolly Rancher. Yeah, because, because oh actually. Yeah, I don't know how I feel it, about it. I lost right. my Hang on, hang on girlfriend. Girl. We're coming up on construction, so I gotta turn off the video so I can pay attention, okay? So today is one of those days where it's once again a little too hot to actually do something outside. So I figured whew, we need to go um, back to school shopping soon anyway. But as I've mentioned in previous vlogs, Ella does not need a lot of supplies for school because it's kindergarten and, and they pretty much supply everything that they would need. Obviously she needs a little backpack, so we've been on the hunt for a backpack. We found one at Justice, and then I realized I forgot my wallet in the car. So it's still currently on hold for me, but I almost want to go on Amazon and see if I can find and one. then I find little keychains are so cute, and I found a rainbow one for yeah, the you baby, were, but you were too I found busy. a white tiger You were too baby. busy looking at all the toys, the stuff that we weren't supposed to be looking but at, But I right? found a white tiger. And she had a little bow on her forehead, and I wanted to get her so bad. No. <laughs> oh, actually, uh -huh. I'll get that for my birthday. Okay. Um, so we found a backpack, but the, the problem is, like, I'm finding a lot of backpacks, but she's so little, and all of these backpacks are so much bigger. They're, like, for middle school and high school kids. So I need to find... If you guys have any suggestions, maybe please let me know, but, like, I need to find, like not toddler she's not really a toddler anymore but like littler kid backpacks and like i said the one that we found at justice um was smaller sized and because she's not going to need a lot like i literally think all they bring to school is they said an extra now this is like memory from my little orientation i went to when i met her teachers but they said something about like a snack 
like a sealable peanut free snack and then a change of clothes in case they like spill something on themselves but um, I'm gonna be having like an open house and I think I'm gonna go to that by myself but not until August and I'm like I don't want to wait to go <laughs> back to school shopping in August where everybody else is going back to school shopping um, but it's fine I still have to go out because I still need to like clear her closet out and stuff and figure out what I actually need to buy her for clothing I know she needs shoes that's another thing it's because Payless is closed I don't know where to go for shoes I don't know where to go <laughs> I have no idea like I know where to get kids shoes but they're always so flipping expensive I don't know maybe I'll check like see even like kids foot locker would be expensive and places like that so I don't I don't really know yet um, I gotta do some more research um, I believe she's probably in size 11s now I don't know when the shoes officially change from toddler into like kid sizes the sizes are so confusing to me I'm still trying to figure them out um, but I still figured that we could shop for some like accessories from school um, some new headbands and stuff so we did jump to Claire's real quick and I did find her a couple things for her birthday party so I'll show you those real quick um, but I did find this little like marble holographic gift bag because yeah Ella has birthday presents next month and then I found her um, I know I already bought um, the haul should already be up at this point her birthday party haul so this is just kind of add-on but I know I did show that I got like a little unicorn headband but I did like this one better it has a little holographic unicorn with a diamond and it actually does say happy birthday and then I got her uh, isn't this perfect? It's a little unicorn pin and it says uh, birthday unicorn and it was one look? left. Yeah, you can look at that, but that's for your birthday. We're gonna wear that on your birthday. And then for school, so we're not wearing these until school starts because I don't want to get ruined. Um, but I just found her a little pack of multicolored headbands. This is we're always I wearing headbands. Love you too. No, it just says birthday unicorn. It's like yeah. a <laughs> I like well, I, just... I love you still. Um, so all different like multicolored pastel sparkly headbands. Mm, get that too. Look at it, yep. And then I got they're her. Like they're like glittery. They are glittery. They're sparkly. They're beautiful. Ooh. I figured when like mama can do all your hair really pretty for school, we could put on like accessories and stuff. Can you get that um, too? Because I want to see that gold and shiny. Yep. But you just got to be careful with these, okay? So I got her two little stretchy headbands okay, as this, well. This and here, we tried these on in store to make sure they actually purple. fit. Um, so we got this little oh, yellow, yellow and gold one. These are the same. These are the, like the same headbands. Yep. But they same style but this one's like pastel like a lavender and white and gold so oh maybe I should have seen if they had like a silver one but too late <laughs> hi Bubba what's the matter honey oh hi bud <laughs> delicious it's a little too hot outside today isn't it honey the floor is nice and cool on you it's nice and cool